I'm a photographer, an entrepreneur, an educator, coffee addict, an animal lover, and an all-around hot mess. Welcome to my life. I am Matt Matthews. Get it, baby. You gotta get it. I <laughs> can't. You got to. You got to. You got to get it. Give me this. Give me this. Yeah. Okay. What's up subscribers? We are in Denver, Colorado this weekend for two boudoir sessions and my Denver, Colorado workshop. So uh, we're just hanging out here in our Airbnb right now getting ready for our first client. Um, and then, damn y'all, yeah, I have to be so loud. Um, and then tomorrow is my workshop. Super excited about that. I'm not real excited about Denver though because I thought this was about to be something that it is not. I was expecting some mountains and some trees. And this is what I got. But, I mean, somebody tell me what this is. I'm done. It's a wrap. I'm done. You're gonna do it with me. So we're gonna crawl onto the bed. Hand out and out. One's up. Bring one and then drop that lower back right there. So keeping that lower back drop and bring those hips back. Perfect. Beautiful. Okay, relax. It's going. It's going. <laughs> I hate this place. All this traffic, I don't know if you can see, but Matt, tell us why you hate this place. Mm -hmm. It's some bullshit, it ain't no mountains here. We ain't seen one mountain. Well, give me this thing. Do y'all see a mountain? Gigi, do you see a mountain? Where is it? Where is it? <laughs> you know what though? At least in Alabama, in Birmingham, they be shooting folks up, killing everybody on 48, on first 48. Everything, but it's better than me. It's better. We ain't seen nothing. nothing. Nothing interesting. Nothing. No good food. Nothing. We're disappointed to say the least. To say the least. We leaving out tonight. <laughs> <laughs> On a red eye plane. Was it red eye plane? Yeah. Yeah, that's what we do. But for real, we driving to the mountains. Oh. Where? Oh, yeah. We literally pulled off on the side of the interstate for a quick picture. I don't know if you can see, but that's Matt over there, very far away. Get your shoes, shit. Look at Matt running. <laughs> so stupid. Oh God, now she's stuck. <laughs> she's stuck. It. Maybe it was it popped up. <laughs> Just casually walking back. It's fine. Titties out in Colorado. <laughs> Knowing he's out of breath because he just ran. I just ran, baby. I can't breathe. Oh, a bitch can't breathe. So I'm here to tell y'all we getting some blizzards at Dairy Queen. It's the highlight of the trip. The highlight of the trip. We just finished shooting amazing boudoir photos in Estes Park, Colorado, which is actually really pretty. Mountains, beautiful creek, everything. 
I got my weed gummies and I'm ready to go. We're gonna go back to the house, get some sleep and some rest, and tomorrow's the workshop. So, get ready. What's up, subscribers? So, it is day one of my Denver, Colorado boudoir workshop, and we're about to get started. So, I wanted to give you a quick little tour of the house that we're staying in for the weekend. So, this is the old renovated church. We'll give you guys a little bit of a tour. The living room. This is Geneva being lazy on the couch. Sam, I already thought that was up. <laughs> 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 I've lived in a place with ghosts, or I've been caught out. No, it's ghost stories. There's two things I want to say. One, I'm going to say something. Right? Uh, just this, I like to use a lot of backlight. So we have just this one window coming in right here, and then we have no window over here, which is exactly what I like. The only thing is, this is a little bit of a problem of right here is we have this window coming in here, so this is going to be a feel light coming in to their body. Um, but what I like to do is, what are you doing here? Sydney. Sydney, okay. So what I like to do is just start with simple poses that they're going to easily be able to get into and just make them feel comfortable. So I always like to just start with just very simple, just kind of get them in the feel of things. And then once they're comfortable and they've been, you know, doing it for a minute, then you can do more of the complicated and, you know, get a little... Um, so what I want to do is make sure that my client's legs are staggered. So I want to bring one leg down just a smidge, and then bring this leg right here for me just a little bit. And then just kind of um, think of pushing that chest up for me to get my arm right underneath your belt, uh, right underneath your back. Perfect. And then I want you to just close your eyes and just continue to breathe out just like that. Now when I start this, if I shoot her from this direction, it's going to be a soft, even line. So the key is to get everything as close as possible in camera. So you want to get it pretty much spot on in camera, and then once you do that, then you can go. <laughs> Got it. What's up subscribers? I am back here in Birmingham, back in my studio and uh, getting things ready for my next workshop in San Francisco, California. Ooh, I lied. I'm going to New Orleans first, then San Francisco. Um, so thank you guys for watching. 10 out of 10, don't recommend Denver. Shit home. Um, make sure you hit that subscribe button below, follow along on Instagram for more, and stay tuned for more videos. Thanks for watching.